Hello YouTube, this is Witchy Jacqueline and welcome to my channel. How is everyone doing today? Well, this video is another diamond painting unboxing. Yes, it's already taken out of the package and all that stuff because I previously did record this video and it was a mess. So I'm just redoing it. And also, there's a little twist to this. I accidentally ordered two of these. So, I went ahead and finished the second, well, the first one. And I'm going to show you the second one that's not done yet. So, you'll get to see this, what it looks like when it's finished. So, I thought that would be something cool to do. Since I accidentally ordered two, I didn't mean to, but it was just something that I ended up doing so I got two of the same diamond painting which is fine because I can have this picture in another room in my house which is fine okay so let me just get going and start sharing with this for you all right so you get your basic tool kit you get the black tweezers you get your single uh, diamond placer you get one square of wax and you get your green boat so that's what comes with this kit this is a special diamond kit so I'll show you these all these beautiful gems here in a second and here is the painting it is the Virgin Mary she is beautiful she is very, very beautiful. And this is the close-up. Let me take the plastic off. Here for you guys. It's a nice, thick canvas. The canvas actually has sparkles to it. I don't know if you can tell on this camera. But here's a close-up of the... Of the symbols that we use really easy to read this is a partial she is beautiful I ordered this because I wanted to try it out a partial and I am attracted to religious paintings anything that I don't know that I just find them to be the most gorgeous art pieces ever so I wanted one so this is my first one for me to get I am I'm already gonna I already want to tell you I'm gonna order more of these but different types it's not gonna be another Virgin Mary but I'll probably get I don't know I'll surprise you guys but I'm gonna definitely order more of these because these are awesome like yeah I love doing the special diamond paintings even if it's a partial, I freaking, I enjoyed this. And it took me one day. Well, it took me, because uh, I took breaks in between. So I would say it took me about three to four hours total that I worked on this. And, with, and that's counting the breaks that I took in between. I took my time with it. I was watching some YouTube videos while I was doing this and it was a lot of fun. This is like, it's so beautiful. I think it's beautiful. So freaking beautiful. So let, let me share with you all the drills that come with this. Now it didn't come with a, you know, a piece of paper that had the list of things or anything like that so but the nice thing about this canvas is that it has the chart over here on the top and then it has one right here on the bottom so that's really freaking cool I like that and I'll give you a close-up of what that looks like you got your your symbols here and then it's got the DMC symbols here for all the gems stones 
rhinestones and I think there's one um, baby diamonds in there there's one pack of those and then all the other ones are like the yeah you'll see here in a minute so I'm just gonna pull these out and I'm going to just show you these beautiful gems that came with this freaking gorgeous we'll start out with these ones look at these look at how sparkly so these are all like silver clear freaking pretty very very sparkly and then there's greens yeah so freaking there these are so beautiful this light blue this re, the, when I was putting this on the actual painting I was like and I had this underneath the light I was like oh my gosh this looks like ice so I really love this color because it looks like ice when you like have them all facing up the same direction and then there's a beautiful dark blue and then there's a darker blue right here right next to that this one's a little more turquoisey compared to this one. They're all freaking gorgeous. Yeah. Love, love them. I love this. I love this diamond painting. I had so much fun. And then look at these ones. Those are fun. They're like the teardrop shaped. Look at that. Oh, they're so freaking beautiful, guys. And then here's those AB ones. They got the backs of these, the bottom of them where you actually, the part that you lay on the actual canvas is black. The top of it that actually shows is the silver part. So, but those are the AB ones. These are like really, really, they have, the difference between these is that, um, they're tinier than these and the cuts like the diamond cut it has several of them on top of them so it has and it actually has a point at the very top of these so they're they're very different and unusual they have more cuts to them than your regular um your regular drill your round drill would have so those are really nice and pretty. And then, and then look at these ones. Let me see if I can get them. These are really pretty. Yes, they're like a, you know how peacock feathers have all those different beautiful blue colors and greens and all that. That's, that's what this color reminds me of, is peacock feathers. Because it just, you can just see all the different shades of the colors every which way this thing moves it's really pretty these are really pretty so I have those and then it came with these three little gems yep and then I got these little pearly pearly little things here and we got some bigger size pearly little things here Oh, and they got like this um, opal, the opal shine to all of them. So do these little ones. They got like that opal shine to them. And then I got even little, little tinier ones for those. And that's all the beads that come with this kit. Quite a bit. Now I'm going to show you the finished painting of what it looks like when it's finished it turned out so beautiful now I already like prepped it and got it ready for me to hang on the wall so I have it trimmed I already have it bordered with washi tape and I trimmed what I didn't want after I already put the washi tape on it so just so you know um and then once I'm done showing you that, I'm going to share with you how many diamonds that I had left over the project. And then I'm going to give you the 
where I bought it, how much it cost, all that stuff after I'm done showing you everything. So let me just grab the finished painting. So this is the finished painting. Oh my God. Isn't it beautiful? Look at that guys. Oh my God. I freaking, I freaking love it. I freaking love this so much. It is so gorgeous. I couldn't wait to finish this and share it. And I was like, you know what? What a perfect way to do this video. And I use like a rainbow effect type washi tape. I don't know if that was the best choice to use, but I don't know. It's really flashy, but that's what I use. So I'm going to hang this in my bedroom for now. And then when I get finished with the second one, yeah, I freaking love that. Oh my God. This was, I'm, I'm not even going to, I'm yeah, this was so much fun. I had so much fun, but you can see where the, you know, where you didn't have to put the drills and everything. So, oh, isn't she beautiful though? Oh my God. I, I really enjoyed doing this So, Yeah. I can't wait to hang her on my wall. Oh, she's so beautiful. All right. So I wanted to share with you how many of these gems and rhinestones and everything that I had left. This is all what was left over. I had quite a bit left over. So I had these big ones. That's how many I had left over. Um, those little teardrop ones. I had quite a few of those left over. I don't know how much, but yeah, there's like, yeah, there's a few in there that I had left over. So, and then I had a lot of these little guys left over. Yep. And I had these all scrunched up in the baggie. And then I had a lot of those little baby pearly ones left over. Um, and then I had some of the other little pearly ones. So I had small, medium, large pearly ones. I had some of those left over. I had some ABs left over. Now I saved the label to these just in case that, um, I just saved them. Because whatever I have left over from the other kit, I'm just going to add them to these little baggies that I have made up. And then, yeah, I just, I have tons of these rhinestones. I have tons of them left from, like, each color. I got quite a bit to, like, play with. So, yeah, a lot of extra. I had tons of these silver ones left over. A lot of the green color had a lot of those left over a lot of those left over like there's a there's a lot in there I don't know how well you can tell but there is a lot left in these bags and then just a little bit not not a whole lot but a, you know quite a bit left over of those ice blue colored ones so yeah so those are all the the special diamonds that were left over after getting this finished so and I'm definitely saving these I gotta put these in a bigger ziploc -y. all right so the cost where is my okay so I bought this on Amazon it wasn't through Prime so I had to wait uh, I or well I ordered on March 12th that's when I ordered it and I received it uh, on March 26th, um, which was yesterday. The cost of this was $4.80. I paid $2.99 for shipping. So the total for just one of this one painting was $7.79 for me. I saw the same painting with the special, the special uh, drills, 
special diamond painting, the same exact picture, same size. They were asking for like $20 at different stores on Amazon. And this was the cheapest one that I found. And it's, and I'm completely happy with this, the cost and everything. It was, yeah, freaking love it. Oh, I love it. It's it's so beautiful. So it, it's very much worth it. Now this is a, a special drill, excuse me, partial, and it's a 30 by 40 centimeters. Um, I'm going to go over the measurements here with you too. So, and the store on Amazon that I got it from is called Green Dot Forest green not the word dot the actual like period dot <laughs> at the end of the sentence yeah it's green green forest so sold by green forest i'm sure if you just typed in green forest you would be able to find it on amazon freaking gorgeous and the price is amazing for what you're getting so yeah check it out I don't know if there's any left at that store I haven't checked but I'm gonna see what else that they might have of any like religious um, pictures paintings like this and hopefully I can get them for a really good price like that again but let's go over the measurements here I'm gonna go ahead and put the finished one aside here because I'm hanging her up all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and measure this. Where's my tape? Here it is. All right, so it's supposed to be 30 by 40. Oh, I'm all knotted up here. I'm all knotted up. 30 by 40, I wanna make sure I grab this centimeter side. Okay. So, it's 40 this way, canvas, all the way to the canvas, it's 40. And then this way it is it is 30 this way exactly so it means what that means is it's the canvas is what that size is the painting the actual size of the painting on the canvas is 33 and a half yeah 30 a little over 33 and a half to let me see a little over 33 and a half to by I should say by um, 24 centimeters so yeah but it's it's still a good size that's a decent size for a picture and for it to be a partial I, I, I'm really happy for that price too and it's it it's so pretty <laughs> Let me show you it again. Like, let me compare. Like, the, that's the, you know, now look at it. She's freaking beautiful, guys. I love her. Oh, it's so gorgeous. I can't wait to hang her up. <laughs> oh, so anyways, I, I couldn't wait to sh get this finished and share this whole video with you. Um, but yeah, check it out if you want to purchase this and give it a try. This was really, for it to be a partial, it was really easy and it was fast to do if you're just, you know, looking for something a little bit easier and not too tedious and everything like some of the other paintings I was doing. I suggest to try one of these partials to start out with because they are so much fun and you get gorgeous gorgeous rhinestones and all kinds of fun little gems and stuff yes and you get the proper tools to handle all these and everything so um, I did use the black tweezers to place a lot of the bigger sized um, I would call them beads because they look like beads like the pearly ones and uh, yeah I used the tweet and they worked perfect it was it made it really easy they they held around each of the the drills I should say the special drill they 
it, it snugged around them perfectly so I wasn't losing anything. Oh, I had a loose diamond there. I had a loose one. I hope I didn't lose it on the actual painting. Nope, it was just one loosely just laying there. Yep. <laughs> it might have fell out of one of the one of these. They've been, you know, they stick to me. <laughs> I find them sticking to my arms sometimes, and I'm like, oh my gosh. But anyways, yeah, this is this was really easy to do. It was really quick to put together. It took me a couple hours, but still, it was it was so much fun. And she's so pretty. It's a beautiful thing to put on your wall. But and they have all kinds of different types. If you don't like this particular pa painting. You can go on Amazon or wherever that you want to shop at and find special drills that have different, totally different pictures. This was just something that caught my eye and that I was attracted to. I thought she was really beautiful. And I'm definitely going to order some more special gem diamond paintings. And they're not all going to be religious ones. I just, this was just something I really wanted to do and really wanted to have on my wall. So she's going to a special place in my area, in my room here. So, yep. She's going to be near my buddy over there. I have like a little memorial table set up for my friend that passed away. So he was really special to me. So she's going to go right above him where I have his uh, little candle and rosary and everything set up over there. Yeah, she's going to go on the wall right above him. So, yep, she, hopefully she can give his soul in some peace. So, yeah, I love it. I freaking love it. She's gorgeous. All right, guys, that's all for today. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for being subscribed to me. Oh, and before I go, I want to give a huge hug, a big hug and a huge I love you and a huge thank you to Carrie. Carrie's uh, down the rabbit hole. Carrie's down, Carrie's down the rabbit hole. Oh my God. If I screwed that up, sweetie, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, it's really late at night here in New York. And yeah, it's like, it's probably like three o'clock in the morning right now. But anyways, I haven't even checked the time. I'm not even gonna because I'm scared to see what actually what time it is. But I want to give you a huge hug and thank you. Thank you for giving me a shout out on your channel. So I'm giving it in return on my channel. Everyone check out Carrie's going down the rabbit hole or Carrie's down the rabbit hole. Hold on. I'm going to get this correctly so you guys know how to find her and you have to because she is amazing she's an amazing beautiful human being and you need to subscribe to her because she is just that freaking cool carries down the rabbit hole yes <laughs> carries down the rabbit hole okay i got it i think i got it right the first time <laughs> but no everyone please go check out her channel and let her know that I sent you and give her a huge big hug on her comments. Give her a huge thumbs up. Yes. She does. Um, I love her. Um, when she does her, um, spinning. Oh my gosh. It's so relaxing to watch her spin, but she does her own spinning. Um, she's been dying her own yarn lately too. A lot. She's been doing that a lot. Uh, beautiful colors that are, that is that she's creating um yeah it's just it's it's really fun to watch her and she does live streams one every once in a while um she's such a beautiful soul though please give her channel a chance and watch her because I love her and she and I'm gonna tell you she's awesome so yes sending big hugs to her because she's yeah, it was so nice of her to give me a shout out on her channel. And I gained two new subscribers because of her. And that's freaking awesome. So thank you again, Carrie. You're, you are a beautiful soul. 
a beautiful human and I, I do love you. Thank you for being my friend. All right, everyone. So on that note, don't forget to check her out, please. And subscribe to her because I told you so. <laughs> but anyways, I hope everyone's doing well. And uh, have a beautiful day. Blessed be and bye for now.